Hi there, and thank you for listening in to this week's weekly health update. Today I wanted to talk to you about a growing concern and in, 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 in an epidemic that's occurring in the United States, which is um, adults being overweight or obese. And this was an article taken from JAMA Internal Medicine in June 2015. Dr. Lin Yang, a postdoctoral research associate from the Washington University School of Medicine in St. Louis, States, less than one third of Americans are currently at a healthy weight, while the rest of the United States population is either overweight or obese. Obesity is not getting better, it's getting worse. And it's uh, scary and it's not pretty. This generation of Americans, Americans is the first that will have a shorter life expectancy than the previous generation. Obesity is one of the biggest contributors to this shortened life expectancy because it's driving so many other chronic health conditions and problems. So you know if you're listening to this video whether or not you might be on that borderline of overweight and obesity. And the question I have for you is do you want to be a contributing factor to Americans over one third uh, growing in, in obesity, which is going to have a lower life expectancy. Well, if you frankly don't care if you're going to live longer, then this really message and video is not for you. But think for a moment for your children or your grandchildren or or a significant other on, on, on maybe not your own selfish cares or wants or needs, but maybe theirs. So start your Start your journey and maybe perhaps losing some weight and not making it such a big picture of we all know in order to lose weight, we need to eat well, we need to exercise. Well, what I've learned is, is you have to have a motivating factor. And I know for myself is I don't like exercise. Who does? If someone tells me they like exercise, you're a liar. OK, we like how we feel when we're done exercising, okay? So understand the importance there. So, but so, so many of us have such a difficult time in getting out there and exercising, um, so we never get to that point of post-exercise and feeling the kind of euphoria of that. So everybody has a different motivating factor, and I challenge you today, okay, or this week, to find that motivating factor, whether it's a significant other, or whether it's just, you're just tired of feeling lousy, okay? If you need help in getting started, please contact myself. I'd be happy to help you get that jump start you need or, or go online and just find what that is, what your purpose is, what your motivating factor is. That's why I do these videos, not for any other reason than to hopefully find one person out there that says, you know what, darn it, I am overweight. I am not feeling good about myself. I feel lousy. It's time for me to make a change. So if you're one of those people, I love it okay let me know share send an email to me and say you know what dr coletti i watched your video and for some silly reason i don't know why maybe it was your bald head i don't know but i you motivated me to get up and start moving because i did not want to be a statistic in creating americans in obesity and having a le a, a lower life expectancy that's enough for me on this week's health update. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful week. And in any way or form or fashion, if I can help, please do not hesitate. Call the office, Big West Health and Rehab. Dr. Coletti signing out. Thank you and have a wonderful day.